Hello, my name is Alejandro Martel Santana, and I'm going to present the paper Design, Development, and Evaluation of a Serious Game aimed at addressing bullying and cyberbullying with primary school students. This paper is based on my research plan for my PhD dissertation and education in the Knowledge Society doctoral program at the University of Salamanca supervised and mentored by Dr. Marta Martín del Pozo. The arrival of technologies in our life has made a significant change in the way we live. One of them are video games, which can be used not only for entertainment, but also in education. Considering that our world focus on two issues, video games as educational resource and bullying and cyberbullying in schools. Regarding video games, they allow us to work on a practically any area with their curricular content, emotional issues, or skills development. Likewise, they are also capable of activating critical thinking and promoting change in student attitudes, thus allowing to address another problem that we find in schools, which is school violence in its very context. With regard to bullying and cyberbullying, despite too numerous awareness campaigns or measures established to address this problem. Statistics indicate that cyberbullying case increased exponentially over the years. As Sahat et al. says in 2021, it is necessary to have bullying prevention and treatment program designed to reduce the phenomenon of bullying in schools. In this sense, among these tools, we can find serious game understood as type of video games. Serious games are those that, without losing their game nature, are intending to serve certain educational purpose. The use of the so-called serious game provides a novel educational option with a great playful and pedagogical character, as well as being a very interesting resource for working on the eradication and prevention of school violence. Taking into account the previous theoretical framework, this research consists of two studies. The main objective for the first study is design a serious game considering pedagogical, technical and game design issues using the RPG Maker tool as a didactic material to work on knowledge about bullying and cyberbullying, as well as empathy and assertiveness in primary school students, valid according to experts in the field of education, technology and video games. Considering this, the starting hypothesis is the serious game created as a didactic material to work on knowledge about bullying and cyberbullying will be barely considering the pedagogical, technical and the game design criteria based on experts. The main objective for the second study is evaluate the effect of using a self-created serious game on the knowledge of bullying and cyberbullying as well as on empathy and assertiveness of primary education students. In this way, the starting hypothesis will be the serious game creators will contribute to increase knowledge about bullying and cyberbullying, as well as improve empathy and assertiveness of primary school students when used in the classroom as teaching materials. Considering the previous issues, the methodology is also divided. Regarding study 1, evaluative research based on expert judgment is proposed, with a sample form by professionals in the field of education, technology and video games. As for study 2, a quantitative quasi-experimental approach is proposed with pre-test and post-test to a single group of primary education students. Regarding instrument, in order to achieve the objectives in study 1, the instrument will be based on the adaptation of other valid instruments for assessing digital resource. In study 2, the instrument will be a questionnaire that will include scales and other instruments validated by other authors. 
In conclusion, the aim is to achieve an educational tool that allows a significant change in knowledge about bullying and cyberbullying as well as in students' empathy and assertiveness. Also, once the research is completed, it is expected to contribute to the educational community with this serious game so that it is accessible throughout the internet for those teachers or educators who wish to use it. We hope that this tool, in conjunction with other resources, will be effective in the fight against bullying in schools. Thank you very much for your attention. Have a nice day.